And you'd be like, ooh. I'd be like, ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> All right, so let's, ooh, get into this. You know. What's up, YouTube? Snoopy East Boy back again with another mukbang, and today we are having nothing. <laughs> Y'all remember B Loves did that? I thought that was kind of dope. Anyway, um, <clears throat> there's no fancy packaging on this mukbang. This mukbang right here, we're going around the world. <clears throat> it is my first time ever trying Sri Lankan curry, chicken curry, and their version of roti, which is like a it's a cooked or a fried bread. All right, <clears throat> so there's no labeling, no packaging. I can't pronounce the name of the place. Plus, it was written in their language, right? But I did go there with uh, somebody from work. And <clears throat> I got the rice and the chicken. <clears throat> Excuse me with my uh, throat. I hope I'm not getting sick. Um, but anyway, yeah, so he had ordered this. And I said, let me try some. He's like, yeah, go ahead. And I tried it, and it was banging, super good. So I said, you know what? I'm doing this. On my channel today so i have a see-through glass container of course it's see-through and it just comes this is a large so it just just comes in a little styrofoam thing like this right no labels no nothing that's how you know the food is bomb right um <clears throat> but i said i was gonna put it i have to put it in something i can't put it on my cutting board so you guys can see it better because it's got a lot of sauce a lot of gravy right so with that being said, we'll get right into it because it's nice and hot. I don't want to eat it while it's hot. <coughs> Excuse me. And um, yeah, good morning, good morning, good morning. Happy Friday. The weekend is here, you guys. All praises, and we're thankful for making it to the weekend. So, this is what the road to looks like. Oh man, I can't wait to tear into this and get this down a little bit. There we go. Okay, so I'm gonna ladle this out. Uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna do this. Let's see. I'm probably gonna end up getting really messy, but it is what it is. So good. <clears throat> this out of my way so I don't spill it. And then to drink, I have some ice cold peach tea. All right, so we'll get into this. <clears throat> I got my shout outs on deck. Ready to go. All right, so this is what it looks like. You guys can kind of get a look at that without me spilling it. Oh, it smells amazing too. All right, so I'm gonna break a piece off of this, break a piece of this roti off like this. I'm gonna dip it in the sauce first, soak it up real good. Oh, you know who I watch do a lot of this? My boy, Mark Wiens, who I always watch. Let's go in. Mmm. Have you guys ever had Like butter chicken and stuff like that. That stuff's bomb too. I will give you a bite, but here you, can, you gotta take it from here. Mmm, right. mmm. Oh, get a piece of that chicken.
Uh, this <clears throat> let me describe this. This it's extremely fragrant, extremely flavorful. It's not over salty, <clears throat> and it's got a nice kick to it. Nice spicy hot heat to it, but it's not overpowering. So I mean, if you want to add more pepper sauce or hot sauce to this, you could. <clears throat> but really and truly, you don't need it. It's perfect. Mmm. I'm so glad that my cousin uh, convinced me to go check this place out. Mm. <clears throat> yeah, so that's my mission for the near future is to um, <clears throat> travel the world and and try other countries cuisine like everywhere like I'm, I I want to go to Sri Lanka I want to go to Jamaica I want to go to Australia I want to go everywhere <clears throat> to try foods hmm I'm so happy I bought this. One of the main places I want to go though. Well, there's a lot of spots, but like Japan and Thailand. I want to sit down in one of the little street market areas and get like the real deal fresh right there. And sit down and eat it. And film it. Definitely, if I had the money, I'd pick a whole bunch of you guys and be like, look, we're going to Thailand for a week. And just relax and take in the sights and just eat all the cuisine that they have to offer. All the best cuisine. Wouldn't that be dope? You don't even need to be rich to do that. I'm just saying... Comfortably, but I mean, you could you could always plan something like that. You know, everybody get enough time and save up, <clears throat> and we all meet up there, get our hotels, shower up, meet up, and hit the street, Thailand, or Japan, or Fiji, or the Caribbean, or wherever. Don't know much about Sri Lanka, <clears throat> but I'm gonna I'm gonna start watching more documentaries on it. Mm. <clears throat> I 
And one thing I'll say about this dish is that <clears throat> um, they, however they made this, they seriously took their time and uh, prepared this like beautifully. <clears throat> and I'm loving that heat in the background. This meal was made. <clears throat> I ordered it. I said it was going to take a couple minutes. So, like five minutes after that, it came out with a hot, big steel pan, like full of this, <clears throat> uh, steaming fresh out the pot from the back in the kitchen. Mm. I know there's a few of y'all that um, hit me up in the comments and be like, Snoop, do um, Cuban food, Puerto Rican food. So these places I got to look to see where they're at. I found three Mexican spots so far and I'm excited about that because I have a very special, huge collab coming up um, next week time. And it's going to be Mexican food layout. When I hit up downtown Toronto, <clears throat> I'm going to hit up this ramen spot that I went to. If you guys remember, if you follow me on Instagram, I posted uh, some video. I wanted to film it, but <clears throat> two things. I just couldn't get the camera right how I wanted it. And then um, it was like like people right next to me. It was just a little bit awkward, you know what I mean? But I, I need to get over that, but it... At that situation was a little bit awkward, but now that I've been there and they said it was okay to, they're actually excited for me to film. Then, excuse me, <clears throat> then I'm gonna film it. But the, that ramen is the best ramen I ever had in my life. Yeah, better. That could be the thumbnail right there. <clears throat> you guys, this is banging. I love it.
Alexa, what flight crashed yesterday? Yesterday's date was Wednesday, January 8th, 2020. Did I ask her the date? <clears throat> Alexa, give me a news report from yesterday. Sean, here's what's new. From Warriors.com, the Warriors head south for a Friday night matchup against the Los Angeles Clippers. Take notice Warriors. and select headlines that every Dubs fan should access to stay up to date on the squad. Alexa, Both on stop. You see, this is why me and her go toe to toe. And then she trying to come at me by calling my name out? Like, yo, you little snitch. <laughs> Real talk. If I was to if I was to vlog just me just you know, just chilling right here or whatever. Trying to get some information or whatever. You should see the funny scenarios me and her be going through. Like, we calling all kinds of names. But. <coughs> Alexa, was there a plane crash yesterday? Hmm, I'm not sure. Anyway. I found out when I was driving to work that I think it was a flight out of Iran. <clears throat> Iran or Iraq. And um, they're saying it was a foul play. I don't know. Then they're saying it was an injury failure. I don't, I don't know how this thing ended up crashing. <coughs> but I'm going to have to really Google it and check it out. I should have googled it before but i was rushing to get ready um but anyway people lost their lives i don't know if everybody passed away in that crash but i know that we lost um i think it was 34 or 38 canadians getting full I got less than half mm. but I'm all out of the uh, royalty man man <clears throat> I wonder what I should bang next I'm thinking I'm thinking to do an inspired video by RDR and get a whole rotisserie chicken and dunk those bad, dunk that bad boy in some uh, stretchy cheese sauce. What y'all think about that? How about that? I wanted to sing a little something for y'all, but <clears throat> I haven't got sick yet. Everybody around me is getting sick or has been sick. I hope I'm not, but <clears throat> we'll see, but I hope not. All right, I'm going to give my seven shout-outs <clears throat> and then get ready to get up out of here. Okay, so first shout-out goes to Sam Babe. Shout-out to you, Sam Babe. And German Etashun. German Germanitashun. I, I don't know. I'll spell it. <clears throat> G-E-R-M-A-N-I-T-A-S. T I O N. Shout out to you. Shout out to Anton Ball. 
That's Motive Beats. He's the one that made my intro. What's up, brother? Shout out to you, man. Much love to you. Um, also, a shout out to A Touch of Love. A Touch of Love has been down with me for, for a good grip now. What's up? What's up? And then <clears throat> Gwendolyn Green. Shout out to you. That's a pretty dope name. I like that name. I like Gwen. Plus, I love Gwen Stefani, too. But Gwendolyn, yeah, that's a pretty cool name. I never met anyone named Gwendolyn other than, like, now on my YouTube. But I've never met a... I don't think I met a Gwen in real life. I'm not sure. Auntie Dar. <coughs> and shout out to Acosta. Hope you guys have a blessed Friday. Looking forward to having a beautiful Saturday and Sunday. Even though the weather out here is um, up and down, but it's cold right now. Just keep me warm. That's what I want to do. <clears throat> I want to do a Korean mukbang. I've never done a Korean mukbang. There's a lot of mukbangs I haven't done yet. In this weather, I wouldn't drive all the way to Toronto, but... If I gather up some folks, then yeah, I'll, I'll go. I'll go downtown, T.O. <coughs> Excuse me. And, um... And I'll do a... I'll do an in-restaurant Korean mukbang. I was thinking about doing it live, but then, I don't know. Maybe maybe do a like a partial live and then finish off with a video. I don't know. We'll see. Shirt looks clean stuff. I did a lot of smashing on that one. But that was hella banging, man. And Sri Lankan food is pretty amazing. I love it. That gets a 7 out of 7 <clears throat> from me. Oh. Alright, you guys. Look. Thank you guys for watching. <clears throat> Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you had something good to eat. Like I said, um, happy Friday. Good morning. Good day to you. I love you guys. Prayers out to everybody who needs it. And until next time, <clears throat> stay blessed, stay positive, stay focused, and keep it crispy. All right? It's your boy Snoopy Eats. Thanks for joining me. Peace out.